America's Stage in the Park is a special show to work on because, uh, I mean, the entire Tampa Bay area has embraced it as a tradition. Uh, we've been out there for over 30 years, American Stage has, uh, and it's just something that everybody comes to. It's really amazing. I, I, I like to kind of make it like the, um, the Hollywood Bowl situation. Everyone's going to come out on the grass, have a picnic, interact with each other, enjoy each other's company, sit under the stars, and then see an amazing show. Well, it is kind of preposterous that we, uh, we're taking a full-size Broadway-style musical extravaganza and putting it in a park in a marina in downtown St. Pete. Um, but it's precisely that that makes it so special. You can really tell the community is so excited about the park show. And I mean, you feel it. You feel it when we're in rehearsal. We finally get out there to work on stage. You kind of see people coming in and, and watching rehearsal, seeing what's going on. We get to make things just so much bigger and brighter and sparklier. And when they're out at the park, we get to sort of hit them with big style and, and, and extravagant looks and colors in a way that we can't do in the theater space. Working in the heat, in the sun all day long is quite challenging sometimes. So um, that's probably the, the most difficult part about it. As far as like the artistic process, it's really wonderful. We spend a lot of time on casting to find the right people for each show. So the artists we get to work with here, um, in the rehearsal studio and what we find to bring out to the park is really, really wonderful. It's great to get out there and be able to stretch our wings and, and uh, have much more space to dance in, sort of freeze the dancers, freeze the actors to, to have a lot more room to work. It's sort of overwhelming from the, at the beginning and then we realize once the show is up that it's the, the perfect amount of space, the perfect place to be doing this kind of musical. So this year's set uh, is a little different because we're in New York, which is the urban jungle. Well, we've got all this concrete and jungle, but we're also in the middle of Florida. So I'm competing with palm trees, there's a gorgeous beach and a, and a skyline out there that we've got to compete with. So it's really this year, what I did is I built up. <laughs> it's the tallest set we've ever had out in the park this year, um, just to really get that feeling of being in New York. We're going back and reflecting the golden age of Broadway, where everyone would actually get dressed up and go to the theater as opposed to just wearing everyday clothes. Um, they're getting dressed up and putting on a show to go see a show. Uh, so tuxes and gowns and rhinestones, and that'll be portrayed throughout the entire production. Taking the show from the rehearsal hall to the park is always so much fun. And just the energy on any of the previews, all the shows that I've been to, the entire, the entire show is, is an event for the whole community and the energy in the audience, even before the show and at intermission, it's completely different from anything you'll ever experience at another theater, which is so, so cool. 